fit. Well, with May comes Asian American and Pacific Islander Heritage Month, and we here at 23ABC are dedicated to highlighting voices within the AAPI community. 23ABC's Rosara Simone sat down with the community organizer here in Kern County who uses her voice to uplift the Punjabi and Sikh community. Harveen Kaur says there are more than 20,000 Punjabi and Sikh people in Bakersfield alone, which is why the Jakar movement is so necessary. Jakarta Movement is a grassroots organization working to mobilize, empower um, the Punjabi Sikh voice here in California, really to um, build a new legacy for the next hundred years for our community. Harveen Kaur has been organizing since her college days at UC Irvine and says she saw the need to grow her community's civic involvement. Whether it's housing assistance, rental assistance, um, trying to connect people with health resources. Um, we also work particularly in the past, we've done the census, so census outreach, voter registration, um, really just trying to get folks involved. Kaur says most recently, they got involved with the redistricting process. Vote for a stronger and better Bakersfield, a Bakersfield where we stand together and embrace our collective power. And encourage their community to use their voice when it came to the new maps being implemented. But she says their bread and butter is working with students. Students are actively engaging on you know, what is their religion? What is the key? How are they, how can they create like a positive impact on the larger community, on their um, specific Punjabi Sikh community? And how are they getting involved? And what are the, what kind of power do our youth hold? Gore says they teach the students that there is power in the collective. And she is grateful that AAPI month shines a light on their culture. I think this month is it means so much to finally be recognized and seen. As I mentioned before, oftentimes our community does go unseen and does go uncalled on. Right? Gor says she is also glad they are receiving more representation, but she can also remember what it was like growing up and feeling different. She says she wants her students to feel confident in who they are. Stay true to who you are. Don't, don't conform. Your identity is beautiful, your identity is unique, and we don't need to conform to Western idealist beauty standards. We don't need to fit in. You don't need to change your accent. You don't need to pluck and tweeze and do all this other stuff that isn't necessary for you are just beautiful as is. You are intelligent and really don't, don't let anyone diminish your sunshine. Gore says that everyone is welcome to join the Jakara movement and that they are always looking for volunteers. For more information on how you can get involved, head to our website at turnto23.com. In studio, Rosaura Simone, 23BC, connecting you. Still ahead, we share a new community project.